Okay guys, today I'm going to show you how you can go viral on Pinterest and thus get more organic followers and more organic reach. And that means you will get more impressions and you will get more clicks on your blog, on your website, on your affiliate link. You can build totally free your mailing list or whatever you want. So when we come here on Pinterest and when we search for example, let's just say keto diet. And when you scroll through this pin, you will notice something interesting. Actually, you will see that most of these top pins are actually long pins. They are longer than they are wider. And when we scroll back here on top, you will see that from top five pins, they are all long pins, as you can see here. Now, why is that? That is because with long pins, you actually get more real estate. And that means you have more time to catch people's attention, to catch their eye, okay? Because they need to scroll longer to pass your pin. And if you have a good hook, these people will actually keep, click on your pin and you will get free visits. That is why you need to make long pins. Also, when we go back here on Pinterest and when we scroll through these pins, you will see another interesting things. When we go back here on top, you will see that from these top five pins, four, three pins are actually infographics. Infographics are getting more attention. People like infographics be because people actually like facts and figures. And also, if you combine bright colors and you have a long infographic image, people will click on it. You will catch people's attention and people will click on it and you will get free clicks and you will get free traffic. And that is exactly what you need to do. You need to make infographic pins, long infographic pins. So, like I said, you need to make infographic. How do you make infographic? Well, you can go on ChatGPT and you can tell it to make your infographic. You can say something like this. Make me keto diet facts and figures infographic. In this case, it is keto diet. But you can tell it and to create infographics for any topic that you want. And like I said, you need to tell it to create your facts and figures because people like those stuff. They like to see summarized what is most important about that keyword that you are actually targeting. And here you can see ChatGPT actually created this for me. So now I need to create infographic itself. Now for that, I can use Canva. You can register for a free account on Canva. And then here you can simply search for infographics and press enter. And then when you click here, show more, here you can see there is lots of infographics templates that you can use. And again, show more. But our infographics is about keto diet, which means I need a food related infographic template. So here I will simply add food. Okay. And then here, when I click on show more, I can see more infographic templates that are related to food. And I can choose some of these that are actually free. If you're a paid member, you can choose paid even a pro infographic templates that you wish to use. So I need to choose one of these templates here that I think is the best for my infographics. So for example, let's just say I wish to use this template here. All I have to do is just click on it and then I need to click here, customize this template. And now I can customize this template any way I want. So let me just enlarge this a bit so you can see this better. Okay. Now here I actually don't like this color. This is not the bright color. So it won't actually catch people's attention. So I will simply click here and then I'm going to click here and I will change the color of the background. So I will just say, for example, I will choose something like this. Okay. And a bit darker, something like this. Okay. And now this will catch people, people's attention because now these white colors are standing out and that is important. And I can actually change this to be something like this. Okay. And now I can actually change this so I can go back here on chat GPT and I can say something like this, uh, keto diet facts and figures. I will copy that and I go, go back here and I will change this. Okay. But another thing, this font style is not easily readable and I need to change that. So I will simply click here on this T for text and let's just say I will use this one here. So I need to delete this thing here because I don't need that. And I'm going to actually change this. I will say these facts and figures and this I will delete. Okay. And also I will delete this and I will move this here. Okay. And I can also make it wider like this. Okay. And like this. 
and I'm going to move that here and make it smaller so I can fit to my template okay and I can actually make this to be center like this okay now this is easily readable this font style is easily readable and that is important now here I need to start adding my facts and figures so this is my first fact and figure okay Control c go back here and I'm going to change that here okay here you can see what is keto and I'm going to make this like this and move it here and I go back here and I'm going to copy this text here and I go back and I'm going to change this here and here you can see how this looks but this image here I don't like this image I need to change this image so you can simply go back here on on elements and then here you can search for example keto okay keto and then press enter and then click here on photos and you can use any of these photos here okay and if you don't like any of these photos you can simply go for example on unsplash and then here you can also search for keto and then here you can find keto related photos and images that are royalty free it is really important for these images to be royalty free so i will go back here and let's just say i wish to use one of these images let's just say for example this image here all i have to do is just drag that image here and that's it I actually added this image it automatically added on this place you don't need any Photoshop skills whatsoever it will automatically add that image here and now I need to change the second fact and figure so I will simply copy this and go back here and I'm going to change that here okay and this is not number one this is number two okay two and I need to go back here on chat GPT and I need to copy this thing here okay Control C go back here and I'm going to replace this okay and again I need to replace this image so let me just find another image that I can add so let's just say for example I will add this image here okay and that's it I added this image as you can see it is really easy really simple to make these infographics and you can make them literally in 10 minutes it is that easy and then here you can add your website if you want let me just enlarge this you can add your website or you can simply remove this just delete it and that's it you delete this and after you finish your infographic all you have to do is just click here on share and then click here on download and then click here on download again and that's it you will download this infographic on your desktop now all you have to do is just go back here on pinterest click here and then click here on create a pin and then just click here and find the infographic that you just created in Canva this is the infographic as you can see this is a long pin and then guys really important thing that I explained to you a few times in my previous videos Pinterest SEO is important you need to uh, include your keywords in the title you need to include your keywords in the description you need to choose a right board and you need to optimize that board also you need to choose the right tags and also if you're adding a link that link should contain your main keyword that is really important Pinterest SEO is important if you wish to rank high on Pinterest search results that is really really important and you need to do Pinterest SEO I will leave you a link in the description of this video where I explain to you how to do Pinterest SEO that is important and after you finish everything all you have to do is just click here on publish and that's it you will publish this pin and you need to publish infographics every day one infographic every day and after you upload 40 50 60 infographics trust me guys you will start getting more impressions you will start getting more organic followers on Pinterest and then people will actually interact with your pins and they will go back tomorrow to see what is the new thing that you published today and some of those people will actually click on it and you will get free visits organic visits to your blog to your website to your affiliate link and some of those people will actually start buying products that you are promoting and you will start making money and that is how you go viral on Pinterest in 2024 that's it for today guys if you wish to see more ways to make money online make sure to subscribe to my channel and also don't forget to like this video and also on your right side you can see more videos that you can watch on youtube that may help you to make money online